Whoa, I even found a way onto your roof. Those are some persistent zombies, dude. Maybe the cabbage poles here to do to, do to your roofs anyway. Grab a light and you're good to go. Now enjoy these shitty frame. Oh. Oh, well, it looks like the frame rates of. I was about to say that and then. Looks like they settled out a bit. But I would say if they did. I should probably close my door. Eh, maybe later. Anyways, hello everybody, my name is Welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies. Yes, I made a promise. I am bringing you guys new Pokemon Snap because I finally found, found out how to use my HDMI splitter and do everything perfect. I did it, I'm a genius. Call me computer nerd. No, I'm kidding, that's dumb. Anyways. Not my computer's fan. Anyways, in the last episode, we finished a world for the fog. We got the cabbage pole. And this episode, we're on the roof. And we got a lot of zombies to deal with. This is a new enemy, Bungie Zombie. He likes to drop down and just abduct plants. He is a bitch. Anyways, that, that, that definitely. That. Uh, who else are we gonna take? Hmm. I guess that, because why not? Mm. Eh, sure, why not? What's more than that? Take that, if I should take that, why not? Not that. There we go, we have a team. Now, cabbage poles are gonna be essential on the roof. Because the way the roof works is, you're at an angle this angle so if you try to like put a zombie plant plant back here it's just gonna shoot at a plant it's not gonna work well and we're back to only five slots this actually sucks can i can i can i go back please okay, yeah so this is why cabbage balls are essential here uh, the bitch thank you I don't really get what the point of this is, if I, if I have to... Oh no. Yeah, so for now we're kind of just making a column of... Making two columns of cabbage pulse because... Well... That's... It's, it's self-explanatory. It's a catapult, but it shoots cabbages. Go figure. How creative, Hopcap. I mean, I love this game, and it's funny, but, like, you're very creative. That is real. What the hell am I doing? I'm only making putting room for one column of sunflowers. That's what being this is called. Stupid. Now, I can always put one right there, I believe. All right, I can just put the twin sunflowers in that next two columns. Yes. Oh, yeah. These vases, well, they're not vases, they're pots. The pots are, hey, are how you plant down plants. Because you can't just place them on the roof, that's not the worst. They need soil, dirt, and shit. So you have to place them in the pots. The problem is the zombies can eat the sh son of a bitch. This is Bonji Zombie. This is what he does. Commits an abduction. But yeah, so they can just... Eat the pots. I don't know why. But the zombies can just eat the pots, which in turn break them. Which in turn breaks them. And then you can't plant you can't plant anything on them anymore. I think like later in this world we'll be able to plant more pots. I don't know if we get it as like a card or whatever, or like only like the fun only like the midway level. I don't remember exactly. But like, I know at some point... Is this new music or is this just recycled music? I actually can't tell. Whether it is or not is a good question. Get him. Get him. Shoot his ass. Yeah, that's me. Good old heap ass. Yo, I know you just gave me a son, but like, can you give me two more? 
Yeah! Final way! You little shit! You! Oh my god! I forgot they could do that. That is the second thing that Bungie Zombies can do. And it is called Plant Zombies Onto the Pot. And they will walk directly on them. Because as we all know, Bungie Zombies are stupid, dumb, little bitches. Oh, speaking of the devil, we actually have a pot card. Seriously, is this a card? Well, uh, I guess it's a seed. It's a seed. That makes more sense. <laughs> yes, this is a plant. Flower pot. Let you plant. Let you plant on the roof. Hey neighbor, got some new items for sale. I got that good. I got that good shit. Roof cleaners had an extra line of defense for those difficult roof levels. I. I actually didn't know this existed. I knew the pool cleaners existed. I got those, but I never knew there were roof cleaners. I've never seen this before. I've probably seen it and just didn't care. What the hell is this? Oh, there's also a trunk. Look, mag. We got the gold magnets. We will need this later. Not now. I am saving my money. Because I... I almost puffed my bow. Because I am a smart business like that. Anyway, so that 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 There's just some things in life. You just say it, and I mean, you're like, <laughs> uh, that's funny. Like almost every that's what she said joke. But usually someone else says that, and then you say that's what she said, and then it's funny. And I just realized these flower pots are 25 sun. Almost said cent. That doesn't make any sense. There are six senses. This there's sight. Sound, smell, sight, se sight, smell, sound, feel, sight, smell, sight, smell, taste, feel, sound, and that's it. And, oh, there's a sixth sense, which is, uh, quote, a psychic connection in your brain so you can understand people like Shirley MacLaine. Uh, oh, oh, also quote, who wear crystals they bought at the mall. Don't ask me, I quoted it. You, how do you? Question, how the hell do they even get on the roof? Ah, that, that's not plant that. Alright, Squash, you're a defense force. You're the only defense force. Well, you're not the only, since we have cabbages, but like... Hmm? Eh, whatever. Biatch! Yay, murder was committed. That, that son of a bitch! Come on. Why? <laughs> Tom, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm such a child. Well, technically, I am. Oh, it's fall break now. You know what that means. We're gonna plant this time. <laughs> oh, something stop me. <laughs> yeah, it's fall break, so you know what that means. A full week of doing jack shit and plenty of time to record. Phone, shut up. Oh, you know what happened today that I completely forgot? Ex like, well, okay, I'm recording this the 8th. But, you know what happened today that I completely forgot about? Metroid Dread launched. I completely forgot that was a thing. Until I saw Cold Face on. 
Now, look, now, look. She said a thing that was like, oh, Metroid Dread, holy shit. I'm like, oh, yeah, that game did come out. I did forget about it. You son of a bitch. That's what you get. And that's what you get. Ha, that's what you get. You can't pull vault over this. Beyond. Oh, uh, there's one rule. You can't plant spike weeds up, up here. I guess they just like, they just can't fit in the pots or something. But you also can't place them on the roof, so that's just the one thing. No spike weeds up here. Come on, think of it. I don't see a bungee zombie. I just realized I didn't see a bungee zombie in that zombie in that police lineup. Which is a good thing because they're annoying, but like. Ah. Perfect. Like, Alright, I'm gonna wait for a pole vaulting zombie. But then I was starting to think if I should have just placed one earlier. Now this cone has been- Oh, yeah, I did. Oh, hell. Tall nut. Tall nut. Hey, tall nut. Hey, penis. Hey, dick face. Hey, little shit. Hurry up. Thank you. God, I, I hate- I hate fucking heads. Here's what you do, kids. You plant it very early so we waste this pole like an idiot. Like a big, dumb, stupid idiot. And you put a third cabbage pole to deal with this. Oh, yeah. You have gotta be kidding me! And at least at this at least now we have a full column. Some more chip than others. Not him. He is in mint condition. Well, for about 10 seconds, because I just planted him. Not him. He is still in mint condition. I honestly can't tell you why. No, no, seriously. I don't know why him out of all of them are just perfect. I know why he's perfect, because I just planted him. I don't know why the middle ones are so perfect. I just can't really tell you, to be honest. Hey, look at that, we have a full column of twin sunflowers. Which means we have roughly three columns of sunflowers. Which is amazing. Ah, he needs a little I'm just gonna do this. Oh. Wait, okay. But hey, he's recharged now. We got a cabbage defense force. <laughs> Just saying that this game this game sounds made up. This ca this game sounds like if a game if a kid was playing pretend. He's like, all right, so uh, the zombies got on the roof and you gotta shoot at them with cabbages, and uh, they can wear buckets on their heads, and uh, only the buckets have their tongue out. Don't ask why, because I just noticed that. Really, I stared at him for two seconds. I'm like. Oh wait, Bucket is the only one with his tongue out. Huh. That's weird. Anyways. Get out of here. Uh, uh, he's dead. And that 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 cabbage just phased through the roof. I don't know where it went. No. Oh. How dare you! What the hell? No, 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 no! You do not get to drop a cone head in our plane. This is our, this is our field. Get your own, asshole. Anyways, get him. Oh my- that, Dude, they're actually crying. They actually cry if they get to the third stage of being digested. 
it's okay. You live to see another day. And we got Colonel Pult for 100 Sun. Flings corn kernels and butter at zombies. Alright, so he's pretty much the same as the Cabbage Pult, except with a main difference. Oh, uh, this is ladder zombie. Tall nuts don't really work here because, well, they can just ladder over them. Oh, yeah, I feel it. Not recommended for level. They can't play place in place on there. Anyways, this, this, blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. You know the drill. Wait, what was the other thing that I, I got? Because. Sorry, I went to close steam for a second. Anyways. But yeah, so. Nah, just go with this. Oh, wait, wait, wait! No, 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 no! Squash. Squash is a mainstay. I mean, these three are the roof squad, but whatever. Look at that, actually ran back. Actually ran pretty good. I swear, that harmony I did at the end of, I don't remember which level, episode, I think it was like the first half of World 3, because I, I remember like, I, I sang that long melody, and then I got, and then I got the jalapeno, and then, as soon, and then immediately afterwards I started on the jalapeno scream, it's like, I'm like, I am not sorry. <laughs> I don't know why they only started us with three pot with three pots. That's just stupid. Ah, no. More time to grow our flowers. Perfect. We just need one more sun. Perfect. Sure, we could have gotten the sunflower and cabbage pole. But would you? But well, but wouldn't you want a twin sunflower in the? Uh... Yeah, admittedly, that was kind of dumb idea. But anyways, at least I get twice the sun now. I should probably put down a pop here, just in case we get... Just in case we get enough sun for a crown of pop, but considering he lost his arm and he's... Three tiles away from... The crown of balls. From the pot. Yeah, he's dead. Now, I don't even think a Colonel Bolt can deal with you, but I know what can deal with you. Oh, Mr. Zombie. I should really plant more sunflowers. This is, um, what am I doing? Priorities. I say as a conehead just immediately spawned. But here, we get to see the Colonel Bolt in action. That's what he does. He shoots butter at zombies, and they get stunned for about five seconds. But they get stunned nonetheless and pause. And just they just they don't they're not stunned for long, but they are paused. But they do pause for like a few seconds. And C Colonel Pulse is really fun, and one of the main plants I used in Plants vs Zombies too. Butter, butter, butter. Oh, I think it's like a 25% chance for Colonel Bolt to have butter. And a 75% chance to just have a Colonel. After all, he is Colonel Bolt. Okay, that's what you that's what I thought. Oh, yeah, sure. Shoot butter at him after he's already dead. And after he already tried to kill you. See, do like that guy. Shoot the butter before he Oh. Oh shit. I kind of forgot about you. I kind of forgot about everything, so I just didn't realize there was just I didn't realize there was just a zombie in the middle row until it was until he was already nodding on the on the pot. I'm gonna go my bad on that one. Go 
Oh, complete my bad on that one. Anyways. Oh, a huge wave of zombies is a cool chain. If you wouldn't Now, this is ladder zombie. He's a bitch, but also... This is what he does. So, yep. Ow. Well, that's what he does, ladies and gentlemen. He dies. He gets butter splatted on his head. And I think the butter... Act that makes sense if the butter did more damage than the kernels, because, you know, they are bigger. Yeah, uh, I was trying to show off what he does, but, uh, they kind of killed him before he reached the tall nuts. Yeah. Uh, on, what if we just replace the cabbage bolts with the kernel bolts? idea now that I say it out loud. I mean, we get we can have a we can have a three a three and twelve chance to get butter in a row. Look, two, look, three butters in the same row. Yeah, let's just let's, let's let's just not even worry about cabbage poles. Let's get let's make them all kernel poles. Kernel poles are just better. Okay, you're not even gonna let him show off what he does. Huh. I was hoping I could just like take off the take out the pot and then just deal with the take out the whole thing at once. No, no. Anyways, who's gonna finish for and the kernels? Who's gonna finish? Oh, no. Anyways. One place where he actually stays alive is the one place without is the place without a donut. Right, right, let's do this. Show the people what you can do. I mean the people who played this game already know what you can do, but show the people what you can do. See that? That see that. If you place a tall nut or just anything taller than him, he will play that like you no. Know, so the basically the tall nut, you know, the thing that pole vaulting zombies can't pole vault over, he will place a ladder on it and climb over it. It took so long just to show that. Because they kept killing it. You son of a bitch. No. Nah, -uh, not gonna happen. Uh, butter, 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 butter. Yeah. Ooh, butter. Have Oh yeah, uh, Riverd the Riverdale Season 5 finale happened Wednesday. I mean, it was also the, uh, the What If finale. That was cool. So, I don't really know what's the next Marvel miniseries, but... I saw WandaVision, like, as it came out. I think, like, I binged it the day Season Finale came out. Like, so I did that for WandaVision, and then, like, I watched, like, two episodes of Falcon and the Winter Soldier, and then, like, never went back to it, but then I finally came, went back to it, finished it, liked it, watched Loki, loved it, watched What If, loved it, watched episode eight the day it came out, and then patiently waited for the, for the finale, and then that was cool, and then uh, later I watched Riverdale finale, and dare I say, I actually want to see what happens next, uh, for now, we just gotta wait to see what's the next Marvel mini season is. I heard, like, Loki Season 2 is a thing. Which, that's cool. Anyways, Coffee Bean. Plant it on a mushroom to wake it up. Oh my god. I just... I just realized that... Oh my god. Because coffee... Makes every single adult... Wake up. Make... Oh my... God, I just now realized that. Oh my god. Well, let's put a cabbage pole if we replace them all with the kernel, so. Who can we bring? 
I can do some shit. Ready, sit, play on. Ready, sit, die. Now we wait. Anyways. Anyways. Shit. Wrong place. Right time. Alright. Get rid of that zombie. Two butters in a bowl. Good job. Make him stunned forever. That's not what I meant. How dare you. That's not what I meant. I stunned forever. Ever. Okay, well, now he's dead. Your, your purpose is your main purpose. I'm gonna regret that decision very quickly, aren't I? That's gonna be a zombie placed right there. Thank God we are out of the fog and I can actually see. I, I hate it 410. I, it was fine, but like the thunderstorm just... Kinda just sucks. Like, you only can see in the intervals of lightning that happen. And it's just. It just sucks, and I hate it. Yach. Alright, come on. Give me a twin sunflower. Come on. Thank you. Now we just need we just need one more kernel pulse right there, and then uh and do that. Sorry, I'm not talking, I just don't have anything to talk about. That was the wrong place. Wrong time. Get that. Two butters at the same time? And a third? Damn it! Keep, I keep accidentally misclicking and I click OBS. Which closes out of the game. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I, I did something and now whenever it full screens, it uh it doesn't do it right. So that's why I literally had to re-record episode two. Because I played it full screen for the first time, for the, for the first episode. And I was like, you know what, I'm gonna do it again. And so I did it for episode two, but then it was like really zoomed in and only in the corner. So I'm like, what? The? And then I had to. And I realized, oh, that's why. So then I had to go back in and re record episode two. Yo, can you like die already? <laughs> Excuse me, good sir. Can you just commit die already? <laughs> that is quite possible. Ever and it will never say. That's not true. I was in ELA today and I did have to read. And we did legit just read the diary of Anne Frank. Okay, okay. Here's what happened. So, this whole week was testing. You know, TE21 tests, whatever. So, uh, we did that. And for the people like the smart kids who got good grades, you know, like big grades, uh, we. Everyone else had to do a test if they got, like, unacceptable grades or whatever. 
But we got acceptable first. So what we did was we just sat on in the hallway and read basically just the script for a play of The Diary of Anne Frank. It was corny, it was weird out there, it was bad, and it was just regrets. And that's all I'm gonna say. We were just out there reading the script for Diary of Anne Frank. I don't know what this this is in the this is in the this is in our English book. Like the book we have for ELA. You know, like all the poems and voices and dumb shit. Like, there's just a play script in this English book. I actually didn't notice that until right now, and I'm like, what the hell? Why is there the script to a play in an English book? Why is that a thing? Also, I think we might be actually, actually able to get a full rough, a full collection of, a full group of, uh, twin sunflowers, because, well, we have three waves, and that's gonna take longer. And by longer, I mean, it takes the same amount of time, just, for the next wave. Dumb bitch. Oh yeah, this is Pogo Zombie, I never actually introduced him, I just walked over. This is Pogo Zombie. He basically works the same. Did he ever use this? Yeah, he basically works the same as Pole Vaulting Zombie. Except instead of a pole, he has a pogo stick. No duh. Uh, just like Pogo, just like Pole Vaulting, he can't hop over Tall Nut. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh my god, I'm gonna have a stroke. I'm not gonna have- I'm just gonna have a stroke. Just randomly one day, I'll just have a stroke. And Doc's like, well, uh, he has a stroke, and the best we can conclude is, uh, he is just a- a- uh, he's just a dumbass. That's all we can conclude. He's just kind of an idiot. Uh, there's this one girl in my class. Uh, she she kind of sucks. Cause uh, what she does? Oh, oh, I forgot. Ladder zombie actually just uh leaves the ladder there, and it never goes away. So other zombies can walk up it. I'm pretty sure. What the hell is this? What kind of bullshit? Kind of two zombies? See, other zombies. Can we got a flying zombie now. We're gonna die. Humanity's over if we have flying zombies already. In 2009 of all years. But yeah, so there's this one girl in the class. I was sitting there at lunch, and I made a sexual joke, because that's basically all my lunch table was. It's just assaults and sexual jokes. It's an eighth- it's eighth grade. It's an eighth grade lunch table. What else are you gonna get? Yeah, so I was sitting there, and I made a joke. And so, she's like, hey, that's inappropriate. I'm like, excuse me? She's like, yeah, that's inappropriate. I'm like, alright, prude. I remember, I remember that from Hell of a Boss. Because I watched Cherub, and then I looked up what food is afterwards. It is someone who is offended by sexual content. Just like the cherubs. Well, at least he can. He can. Gary. Whatever the hell her name is. I don't know her freaking name. I know she's a deer. She has a dress. She's voiced. She's voiced by Viv. She's voiced. Voiced by Vivi. By Vivzy herself. Damn, why was that so hard to say? I don't know. What I do know is that. Uh... Wait, can I 
kill me if you want to. Yes, I can. Well, the problem is, we have this asshole. We have this big asshole. We have this asshole. Don't you dare. Don't you, d you son of a bitch. Uh, oh gosh. Thank God that's what I was saying. Uh, gosh, 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 gosh. Uh -huh. Gosh, gosh, do it, do it, do it. Thank you. Butter. You don't on, bitch. No, can you not? I'm right here now. Get rid of this. Get rid of the ladder. Get but gets butter. Unbutters get gets buttered immediately. Oh, apparently if you don't kill the last zombie fast enough, the game just gives up. And it's like, oh my god, you're taking forever. Just move on. I'll move on to the next phase already. Move on to the next wave already. Ah, oh, this is a problem. The problem. No, stop, 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 stop. Hey, 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 no. Hey, no. What are you? Hey, no, no, no. No! I. I've never get lost before. Uh. Uh, I'll be right back. I'll, uh, I'll come back once I get back to the final wave. Uh, see y'all in a second. And we're back. I made it to the final wave again. And we're yeah, sure. There's these dumbasses. Bitches. Corn. Butter. Butter. Butter, idiot. Yeah, so I kind of just turned the sound off and watched YouTube while I made my way back to the course of the final wave. And I have my ghost, my full garden of pins and flowers. And the first of my ever done it before. How dare you? Nope. We don't do that. Let me know what we do do. We do this. That's what you get. See, this time I made sure I had five. I had five tall nuts in every. I had a full column of tall nuts, so that way no pogo sticks on. No pogo zombie could get it. It could get down my chimney. Watering can. Now you can play Zen Garden Mode. Hey, check it out. You found a watering can. Get out of this occasion. I present you in your very own Zen Garden. Hey, I'll leave you start off. Here. I'll start you off. Come on, play. Come on, spread. Go there to full size, and then we'll watch you nicely. Have fun. And then the watering, you click on the plants whenever they get thirsty. So basically, this is the Zen Garden. It's a plant mini game growing, clean, whatever. When these plants show the water icon, you water you water them. And in exchange, they give you coins. So they're basically a, they're basically a prostitute. They're basically just a plant prostitute. Now that I say it out loud, there is nothing you can say that will change my life. You need fertilizer. Hey folks, this end got it's actually not shot. I'll give you some fertilizer for stopping by. You can look around and see if there's anything else you like. If there's anything else you like. Hmm. Well, can't buy that. Can't buy that. Can't buy that. Uh, I'm good for now. Yeah, so now we get to fertilize them. Which basically grow them into actual plants. That's all you can do for now. Check back later when your plants need more nurturing. Yes, Zen Garden is a good thing. It's fun. Zen Garden is pretty nifty, huh? You can visit it any time for the main menu. But if that, it's time to defend your house. I have to warn you, you're gonna hate this next level. Bring it to full level. Why? Because it's non stop bungee zombie after bungee zombie. I hate those confounded bitches. I hate them. I hate them with a passion and a vengeance. 
A whoopity do! Here come those dumbasses now! <laughs> what the hell was that? That was just me doing a crazy Dave and then just going really crazy after. <laughs> I don't know what the hell that even was. Uh, I just really. Uh, yeah, and also these, these plants, these pots just bounce up and down. Like they're actual plants, and I don't know why. Don't give me pumpkins! Pumpkins can't attack! Sure, they can block! But that's it! Are you not fun? I'll plant them! Finally! Something I can something I can attack! Chomper! Eat it! You son of a bitch! But we do this. Reset! That's now where I wanted to plant that. How dare you? I probably should have waited for the next to see where the next zombie was gonna spawn. Yeah, it's okay. Da 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 da
Garlic diverts zombies into other lanes. Thank you all so much for watching. Next episode will be the finale, the final boss. Thank you all so much for watching. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.